top of the motherfucking morning. You know what I'm talking about? LDBC, YouTube. What's good, man? This your boy 503 Line, aka K Dub. You know what I'm saying? Checking in once again. I just want to say, man, shout out to my motherfucking brother, Blood Boxing. You know what I'm saying? This dude been rocking with me, bro, like, for the longest. You know what I'm saying? He been supporting me and, and showing me love, man, like, for the longest. You know what I'm saying? Like, and I just want to say, bro, like, that shit you just did, dog, you ain't have to do that. You know what I'm saying? It take a real one to do some shit like that because I didn't ask that man to do nothing. You know, what I'm I ain't asked nobody to do nothing, bro. It's organic. You know what I'm saying? And that's that's what I love about this shit. You know what I'm saying? Cause ain't nobody putting nobody on my, on on this LDBC shit. You know what I'm saying? I'm not going and inboxing nobody. I'm not inboxing nobody to do nothing. You know what I'm saying? I'm just on here speaking my raw emotion. You know what I'm talking about? But I just want to say shout out to the whole LDBC man. Everybody that showed me love and commented and support me, man. Like Deal Town, my nigga Town Business, Blood, Coach Sheldon Harrison, uh, Dream Chasing Boxing. Shout out to the Dream Chasing team. You know what I'm saying? And I, I just woke up, you know what I'm saying, not too long ago. And I seen my boy 78 come in and he told me good work. You know what I'm saying? And, and that mean a lot. You know, because, like, I'm going to just be real. You know what I'm saying? 78 and Blood, dog, they, they the pioneers of this shit. Straight the fuck up and dying. They the pioneers. They the OGs. They the founding fathers of this LDB shit. You know what I'm saying? Or this Lions Den boxing community shit. You know what I'm saying? They started this. You know what I'm saying? And, and we picked the, picked the ball up and ran with it. So, for that, you know what I'm saying? I just want to say thank you to everybody that that fuck with me and supported me and shouted me out, you know what I'm saying? But I got to I got I got to uh, get my rocks off on this uh Loma Chico and Walter situation. <clears throat> I mean, uh not Walter's uh Rigandale. Rigandale is um, a hell of a fighter, man. You know, I, I I hate the fact that he get treated the way he get treated. You know, it's it's fucking disgusting, man. It's nasty as fuck, if you ask me. Um, but that's what happened when you fight on HBO, man, and, and you don't appeal to what they looking for, what they trying to promote. You know, that's just life. You know, but uh, I don't think that Regan Dial will beat Lomachenko. Especially if they fought at 130, man. I just think that Lomo Chico is on a whole nother level. And that's just my personal opinion. You know what I'm saying? I, I, I fuck with Lomo Chico. Like, some of the shit that he does, it's a little small things that this man do. To keep him out of harm's way. You know what I'm saying? But Regan Dial is a hell of a boxer, man. And, um, and if they was to fight, man, I would give it to Lomo Chico, you know. Regan Dye would have to knock this man the fuck out to win, bro. I'm just going to be 100 with everybody. If, if Regan Dye don't knock him out or hurt him severely, if they fight, man, he is not going to win that fight, man. Especially if it's on HBO. He is not going to win. Um. So, Regan Dye, I know you 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 kind of pissed off because Loma Chico get all his praise, man, but... He's the next best thing in the white community. I'm just being honest. He's the, 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 the white hope, you know what I'm saying? He has the complexion for the protection, you know? And we all know Guillermo Rigadal is on the coincidental list. Like my boy Dante Boxing Nation say, he on the coincidental list, man. It ain't no secret. This motherfucker been getting blackballed, man, since, since he started fighting, man, on HBO. <laughs> you know, I got to laugh because it's sad. You know, I, I, I can't let that shit frustrate me, man, because we all know what happened to Guillermo Rigondeaux, man, at HBO. So, we're not even going to get into that. You know what I'm saying? Um, But, yeah, man, that's, that's my thoughts on the situation, man. 
I have to go more deep into it in another video, but I just really wanted to shout out the whole LDBC from, from Blood, man, because you've been supporting me. You know what I'm saying? You was one of the first ones leaving comments and just saying, man, keep up the work, man, and, and it's fucking with me and, and just being real, bro. You know what I'm saying? Blood is, is, is a real is a real dude. You know what I'm saying? Seven Eight is a real dude. Town Biz is real. Jeff is real. Like all this shit over here is one thou wow. It, it, it's a hundred. It ain't it ain't no fake shit. It ain't no fraud shit. It's organic as fuck. And that's what makes the Lions Den boxing community what it is. Cause you got like Blood say you got a bunch of dudes that's on here just talking how they feel, man. They venting. That's all it is, man. Coming on here and expressing yourself with full capabilities. Like Dre said, you know what I'm saying? In the early 90s, man. Just niggas expressing themselves, man. If you got a problem with it, man, then fuck you, man. I seen some dude leave an old faggot ass comment saying LDBC stands for a little dick, big cunts, bro. To, to the dude that left that fucking comment, bro, eat a dick and die, my nigga. Catch A's and die, my nigga. That's just how I feel about it. anybody saying some faggot ass shit like that. Little dick, big cunts. You know what I'm saying? It, for those of you that don't know, my nigga, the African bloodline can never be a cunt. It's too fucking pure. We have the strongest genes and blood through any fucking race in the fucking world. So to the dude that said that shit, nigga, fuck you, eat a dick and die. LDBC, K-Dub Ken, man, I'm gone.